10 awesome food tricks for you to use at home. Now, don't you hate it when you're in the kitchen and you've got dirty hands, but you need to use your phone and it dirties the phone? Well, here's a simple trick. Just take some cling film, wrap your phone in cling film, and then there you go. Whenever you have dirty hands, you need to look at a recipe or text a friend, you can easily just play around with it and you don't have to worry. Now, this next trick is a DIY nut bag, or you can actually fill it up with whatever you want. Uh, take a little plastic bag and fill it up with nuts. Then you take a knife and you heat it up with a lighter. And then once it's super, super hot, then you can cut through the plastic and steal it at the same time. So now you've got your own little DIY to go back and you can fill it up with whatever you want. It doesn't have to be nuts. But if you're crazy and you need some nuts, this is a great solution for you. Now, trick number three. Take a kiwi and cut off the ends. Now, I, I'm not one of those that eats a kiwi with the skin on, so I have to remove it. And this is a interesting, sort of simple way to remove your kiwi skin. So do a little incision like that, and then you take a spoon and just slide it in between the skin and the flesh. And you just wanna curl it round until you get to that cut. And you go all the way around, and there you go. You remove the skin from the pulp, and you can now enjoy your kiwi without the furry skin. Now, when you have food and you leave it inside a fridge in a bag like this, a Ziploc bag, there's always a lot of extra air and this extra air makes your food go off. So what do you do? Place your Ziploc bag with the food inside some water and the water pushes the air out and seals it with less air. So now your food doesn't go off as quickly. It's like vacuum sealed food. Now, this next thing, we all know this, you crack an egg open and there's a little piece of shell in there. Look at it, it's right there, it's just staring at you. Dip your finger in some water and this will allow you to just cut through the egg white and just grab it. There you go, super simple, done. Now, this next trick, you're gonna take a bottle of water, empty bottle and just add one egg, 300 milliliters of milk, 150 grams of flour and two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Then you're going to seed it up and then you're gonna shake like mad. And you guessed it, you've made a simple homemade pancake recipe. And the difference between this one and other ones is you won't be wasting a bunch of bowls and whisks and dirtying everything. You can just simply reuse your bottles of water to make simple pancakes. Now, for this next one, you're gonna take a paper plate and just cut a hole into it. Then you put your hand mixer inside and you've got a little splash guard. So this is a DIY splash guard that will keep your kitchen a little bit more clean when you're mixing stuff. Isn't that great? Simple, effective, perfect for the kitchen. Now, I hope you haven't been throwing away your corks from wines. You shouldn't be doing that. Instead, you should cut a slit into it just like this. And you can just close your bags of chips or marshmallows in this case. And it's just a useful way to use something you would throw away. Isn't that great? Now, trick number nine. You're gonna take some cut up mint leaves and you're just going to spread them out inside an ice cube mold, just like this. And then you're going to ladle some lemon juice over it. Now, you can do this with anything really. You can put some uh, fruit juices in there or something else, whatever you want. Uh, some peach juice might be nice. And then you're gonna to wanna to freeze until it's rock solid. Then you take your tea and you place one of these minty sticks in it and you've got a delicious minty lemon iced tea. Great for summer. Now, here is a DIY Ziploc bag. This is a normal bag. I'm going to stick the top of a bottle over it and then I'm gonna pull it through and pull it over the outside like this. And now I can use the bottle cap to just close it up and this way I can easily open and close it without needing to break the bag or anything like that. 